everyone good evening welcome to my channel in this lecture we will discuss about uh, mosfet like what is mosfet about its uh, working principle basic constructional feature and its characteristics so uh, as i have told in my previous class mosfet metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor mosfet are two type one is enhancement mosfet and second is depletion mosfet enhancement mosfet second one is depletion mosfet depletion mosfet enhancement mosfet are two type one is n channel enhancement mosfet second is p channel enhancement mosfet similarly depletion mosfet are two type one is n channel second is p channel okay so in this lecture we will discuss about uh, only i will be focusing on n channel the basic constructional feature and working principle of n channel enhancement mosfet right so without further delay we will start the lecture my name is sr prusty as you know and you are watching my lovely 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 channel love you science so coming to uh, the constructional feature of n channel enhancement mosfet so construction dekho n channel n channel e mosfet e mosfet i have told mosfet has three terminal kya kya hai one is gate second is drain and third is kya hai source theek hai similarly e mosfet has three terminal one is gate drain and source but actually it has four terminal uh, so this base and uh, that source is being sorted i will explain let me draw the diagram okay let me draw the constructional diagram okay so first point we will take a p type of semiconducting body this ko hum log kya bolte body first point is body or you can say substrate which is made up of p type of semiconductor major part of that in general in mosfet and the two two n type of semiconductor is being diffused or placed matlab two n type heavily doped semiconductors is being kept over p type semiconductor okay and third important part is third important part is what that metal contact so we have a metal contact which is connected to gate drain and source matlab here there is a metal contact which is connected to source here also there is a metal conductor which is connected to drain and here also there is a metal conductor which is connected to body and one more metal conductor is connected here is placed here which is connected to gate but one thing to remember there is a insulating material which is made up of silicon oxide or silicon dioxide is being inserted between that p layer of the body and that metallic contact which is connected to gate it is very important so silicon dioxide uh, will act as a insulating material that's why it is called igfet insulated gate field defect transistor matlab that gate is being insulated current cannot cross this one ye ho gaya clear so ye ho gaya basic constructional feature ha huh. why it has three terminal ye jo two terminal is being sorted through a common wire internally it is sorted ye ho gaya aapka basic constructional diagram next point is important just a minute let me erase okay next point is what is its working principle its the working principle kya hai the working principle kya hai so our main objective is that current has to be flow from drain to source ये याद रखना करंट का जो फ्लो होगा सर्किट करंट का ड्रेन टू सोर्स सो हाउ द करंट विल फ्लो फ्रॉम ड्रेन टू सोर्स सो वी हैव मल्टीपल ऑप्शन विल चेक वन बाय वन सो लेट लेट विल सप्लाई विल प्रोवाइड ए पावर सप्लाई थ्रू ए बैटरी एंड इट इज कनेक्टेड हियर ड्रेन एंड सोर्स रेस्पेक्टिवली माइनस इज कनेक्टेड टू एस एंड प्लस इज कनेक्टेड टू ड्रेन टेल मी 
कैन करेंट फ्लो फ्रॉम ड्रेन टू सोर्स ड्रेन मतलब क्या है दिस कनेक्टेड टू एन सोर्स इज ऑल्सो कनेक्टेड टू एन कैन करेंट फ्लो थ्रू दिस टर्नल टू दिस टर्नल फ्लो देखो क्या होता है एक्चुअली ये क्या ये कौन सा टॉप लेयर है पी है ये क्या है लेयर है मतलब यहाँ पे एक तो डिप्लेसन लेयर ऑलरेडी है एज यू नो पी एन जंक्शन का फॉर्मेशन क्या है मैंने बोला था अगर ये आपका पी है ये एन है इसमें मेजोरिटी चार्ज क्या है और होल इसमें मेजोरिटी क्या है इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एस और नो सो होल मूव टूवर्ड्स एन एंड इलेक्ट्रॉन मूव टूवर्ड्स पी सो दी होल विल लेफ्ट नेगेटिव चार्ज आय एंड होल विल लेफ्ट पॉजिटिव चार्ज आय मतलब in in near the junction there is a layer is developed which is called depletion layer so that means so that means since we have a p type semiconductor and n type semiconductor already we have sorry already we have okay already we have a depletion layer here in between this p and n similarly this one is also p ye to p na ye n hai yahan pe bhi ek depletion layer hai so that means already we have a depletion layer so now if we we'll provide positive supply to drain here it is plus and minus is connected to here so tell me plus is connected to n matlab ye kaun sa bias ho jayega reverse bias ho jayega matlab ye jo thickness of that depletion layer will be more again i repeat if plus is connected to n forget about this part ye to potential zero hai ye to grounded hai na ye potential zero hai forget about this part You just focus on this part. If plus is connected to n, positive is connected to n. मतलब ये n ये p है ना? ये बीच में एक junction है. So if plus is connected to n, what is the width of that depletion layer? It will increase. See, ये मान लो कि आपका p ये n है. Reverse bias क्या होता है? So positive is connected to n and negative is connected to p. मतलब इसका जो width क्या हो जाएगा? बढ़ जाएगा. So मतलब width of that depletion layer will be more. सो करंट कैन नॉट फ्लो मतलब ये जो कंडीशन पॉसिबल नहीं होगा मतलब ये जो कंडीशन ये पॉसिबल नहीं है सो व्हाट विल डू जस्ट लेट मी गेट्स सो नेक्स्ट व्हाट विल डू विल चेंज द पोलरिटी एंड चेक नाउ इफ आई चेंज द पोलरिटी इफ आई मेक इट प्लस एंड दिस वन एज माइनस सी माइनस इज कनेक्टेड टू एन ठीक है ये फॉर्ड बेस हो गया बट हियर प्लस इज कनेक्टेड टू एन मतलब ये तो रिवर्स बाइस हो जाएगा इसका जो लेयर है विथ ऑफ दैट लेयर विल बी इंक्रीज सो दैट मीन्स इन फर्स्ट केस ये जो विथ ये जो लेयर है इसका विथ क्या होता था बढ़ता था सिमिलरली इन सेकेंड केस में ऑल्सो ये प्लस इज कनेक्टेड टू दिस एन मतलब द विथ ऑफ दैट डिप्लेसन लेयर ऑल्सो इंक्रीजेस सो दैट मीन्स इन बोथ द कंडीशन बोथ द कंडीशन करेंट कैन नॉट फ्लो फ्रॉम दैट ड्रेन टू सोर्स तो उसके बाद क्या करेंगे बट आवर पर्पज इज टू कंडक्ट दिस वन मतलब आवर पर्पज इज टू मेक द फ्लो ऑफ करेंट फ्रॉम दैट ड्रेन टू सोर्स फॉर दैट वी हैव टू मेक ए चैनल अंडरस्टूड सो वी हैव टू मेक ए चैनल सो दैट चार्ज कैरियर कैन फ्लो वी हैव टू मेक ए चैनल सो हाउ डू यू मेक ए चैनल टू मेक दैट चैनल द बेस्ट वे इज वॉट इफ विल प्रोवाइड A potential difference to a battery. A plus is connected to gate and minus is connected to source, which is connected to base. Base, right? So what will happen actually? What will happen? Just a minute. Okay. What will happen? ये जो P type semiconductor इसका majority charge carrier क्या है? Hole. So minority क्या है? Electron से. मतलब अगर 5000 hole होगा, 40-50 तो electron होगा. ठीक है? so due to the impact of positive charge positive supply the electron will be attracted but electron cannot cross this one since there is a insulating material matlab electron will be accumulate near this area okay so ye actually kya principle hai ye aap log ko yaad hoga capacitor mein agar ye two parallel fit capacitor you are providing a power supply positive and negative yahan pe kya hota hai positive charge will accumulate and negative charge will accumulate in the lower plate so if we'll put a dielectric here what will happen the capacitance of the dielectric will be enhanced because of polarization effect matlab more and more charge will be accumulate so same thing so by uh, replacing the dielectric we are keeping what silicon dioxide as a insulating material matlab yahan pe the negative charge carrier will be accumulate but 
that is not sufficient to make the channel for conduction of current. इसके लिए आपको क्या करना पड़ेगा इसके लिए you need to increase the potential difference. मतलब you need to increase. मतलब that voltage across Gs, the voltage across Gs has to be increased. If Vgs will increase, again क्या होगा it will it will what attract the ch negative charge carrier but at a particular point you will find huh, in between that uh, if uh, if if sufficient electron will not be there then what will happen if you will increase the value of that voltage the the covalent bond of that atom will break like covalent bond kya hai man lo ki silicon hai theek hai okay ye jo covalent bond hoga in this p type semiconductor if i increase the potential strong electric field will be developed no so this bond will break matlab electron will be free and hole will generate so that free electron will move towards <coughs> understood so matlab free electron will move upward because inside here a strong electric field will be developed understood electric field ka direction kya hoga plus to minus so against electric field electron will flow so matlab flow of electron ka direction kya hoga upward hoga understood so for a particular voltage for a particular gate source voltage you will find this area will be completely filled with negative charge ion so as this body is made up of p type semiconducting material matlab in this area p behavior will be less matlab p behavior will be less will be less since a uh, maximum electron will accumulate in this area okay clear so matlab for a particular voltage this complete space is filled with negative charge ion so that means a channel will be formed so this vgs is called threshold voltage which voltage threshold voltage if someone will ask what is threshold voltage so it is the minimum voltage across gate and source so that a complete channel is being formed okay complete channel is being formed so that current can flow from drain to source but abhi tak current flow nahi hua so just channel is formed this voltage is called vgs so now if your battery if the potential across that gs is more than this threshold voltage then a complete channel will be formed yahan tak clear so that means a channel to form ho gaya so i can draw this diagram as i'll modify this one okay just a minute to isme kya ho jayega ओके देखो ये डायग्राम क्या चेंज हो जाएगा ऐसे चेंज हो जाएगा मतलब ये कंप्लीट चैनल बन गया ठीक है दिस इज द डिप्लेसन मतलब ये कंप्लीट पार्ट नेगेटिवली चार्ज हो गया ठीक है ओके बट हाउ द करेंट विल फ्लो so for the conduction keeping the voltage at here if we'll provide a potential across if we'll provide a potential across d and g gate and drain matlab positive supply if it is given to drain and negative supply is given to gate then if positive supply is given matlab drain current will flow that means if v d g is given then of course drain current will flow according to ohms law current flowing through a conductor is directly proportional to the potential difference matlab current will flow right but at the same time what will happen the the depletion layer since positive is connected to n so the, the width of depletion layer will increase the width of depletion layer will be increased so he, here there are two conditions so keeping the voltage vgs as fixed if we will increase the value of vds sorry vdg voltage across drain and gate 
then no doubt current will flow because current is directly proportional to the potential difference but at the same time the width of depletion layer will increase so in this region it will increase understood so we will be getting two cases one is what current is flowing second is thickness of depletion layer will be increased and obstacle will be developed matlab resistance will be more understood a positive supply is given to this uh, n type semiconductor here this is n and this is also n na a positive supply is given to n the width of depletion layer will be more so wh what is the width of that uh, channel the channel become narrow the channel become narrow so we are getting two case if i increase the value of this voltage current will increase but at the same time the channel become narrow so for a particular voltage for a particular voltage you will find current get saturated current gets saturated which current that drain current will gets saturated so ye jo voltage ko kya bolte pinch of voltage kya bolte pinch of voltage okay and this corresponding current ko kya bolte saturation current understood so matlab current gets saturated then what will happen again we have to increase the value of gs and keeping that value as constant we gradually increase the value of ds and the process will continue understood so that is the mechanism of uh, our basic principle of mosfet okay so hope you guys understood uh, thank you so much for watching my video thank you